Well, it's common to cool down on a hot summer day like this one by drinking a cold beer, but it's also common to drink a brew that maybe you've made yourself. Locals who make their own beer shared their products with people in Reno today for a good cause and a chance at a prize. News for Ashley Cullens joins us now with more. Ashley. Brian, it's the seventh annual Sierra Tap House Homebrew Contest. And organizers say over the years, this event has helped to launch new local businesses. So the next craft brew you buy could be made by one of these competitors. So you're going to have a little bit of everything. We have 25 brewers and 50 different beers being entered into the competition. Sierra Tap House co-owner Zachary Cage says the beers at this year's homebrew contest include everything from ales to porters to stouts. There's something for everyone. Really, really eclectic blends. This is Angela Hansen's first time at the event, and she already has her winner. The oyster blend over there. It's phenomenal. Regular contestant Roderick McNeil of Monster Dog Brewing is impressed with the turnout. The Reno brewing community is amazing. There's a lot of creativity. There's a lot of new beers here, a lot of different things that I've never seen before. Those beers will be vying for prizes, including Brewmaster and People's Choice. We are trying to provide a forum that brings uh, local home brewers together. Uh, in, a, in a competitive environment. McNeil says that competition raises the bar. And every year it gets tougher and tougher because the quality of beer gets better and better. So it actually propels you and makes you become a better brewer. And it's helping a local cause. Proceeds from the $15 tickets will benefit Care Chest of Sierra Nevada, a nonprofit that provides medical resources for people in need. So it's great to you know, enjoy great beer, have good fellowship, good friendship, and then help a good cause at the same time. Cage says Northern Nevada provides the perfect ingredients for good craft beer. We've got great climate uh, and, and great talent and great culture for uh, craft brewing to thrive here. They just announced the winner a few minutes ago. Congratulations to Tyler Brower, who won the top prize for his chocolate milk stout. Brian.